G'day everybody, and welcome back for some more Icarus with me, Kabak, and TFE. And we have some farms, but let's go to bed because it's dark. Oh wait, no, it's 6am. We can't go to bed. Go to bed. <laughs> go to bed. So, TFE, um, let me show you some things I did with the food and you can decide whether you like it or not. Okay. Um, so if we have a look at the electric stove... Uh, there are vegetable pies, which give plus 150 max health, plus 150 max stamina. Uh, there are also shepherd's pies that are plus 225 max health and 150 max stamina. And then uh, vegetable rolls, which are plus 150 max health and 150 stamina. And a bunch of other mixed bonuses in between. But if we look at those, we'd need to grow pumpkins, soybean, rhubarb, tomato, potato corn, soy, and squash, which is what Old I have stuff. planted in the farms out here. Yeah. So uh, we should be able to make up all those recipes. Um, mm -hmm. With the wheat that you'd already planted, we get enough flour to make the pastry. Yeah, and for the animal feed. Yeah, the pastry takes a fair bit. Um, and in the fridges, you'll find there is a stack, at least, of each for each of us. Oh, neat. So we can have proper buffs now. Uh, I also have a food-related announcement. Yeah? Uh, in the kitchen bench here, we can make preserves in the glass jars. Yeah. And we and, and those are good travel food because they don't spoil. Well, so the, the foods that I've made up as well, I have salted at the salting bench. So they don't rot as quickly. So hopefully they'll make decent travel foods too. Mm. But while Delicious we're at Delicious salted home, pie. Oh, actually, we probably want to just carry everything on us, to be honest. Because if we if we put stuff away and only eat when we need to, we will end up leaving too much food behind. And TFE, did you notice that you could fix the um, crop tiredness thing by just destroying that crop and planting the exact same one? Um, yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's make sure. Because I, I thought it might need a different crop to be placed. So it's actual crop rotation, but it's not. It's not the same one regrowing. It's just not the same exact plant. Yeah. Oh, which is convenient. Oh, and thank you for, for to Lexic Time for the um uh alliterative description of the summary of the plot so far. The story so far, our desperate dispirit dis pirated, dissipated, a disparate stream, a disparate team have landed on a planet in a bid to make ends meet and pay the bills. For various personal reasons, they've taken on jobs outside their normal, normal comfort area. <laughs> the company they work for is also cutting corners to the point where there is no point and it's all beveled edges and even flat things roll off the table. They've been kept in the dark and fed scraps of information about the true agenda. Can our mitochondrial miscreants survive, pay the bills, and make it out of their ordeal? That is very nice. The answer is no. Yeah, us being successful never happens. <laughs> uh. <laughs> it might be slightly more likely now that we've got me choking and unable to pay attention. <laughs> and dying. <clears throat> Thank you for the gift sub, Portalis. Oh boy, sorry about dropping. Alright, we'll just blame it on one of the animals in the barn. <laughs> I've got some more ammo if you guys are, if either of you are too short. I'm looking right now, what I want to make is another pair of wind turbines, more copper wire. And another deep mining drill, which means more aluminium and the carbon fiber, which should have some paste over here. Oh yeah, predictions! We need a prediction. Who's going to Who's get going eaten to by Drax it? next? There we go, Inevitable. prediction begun. Um, Thank you for the Prime Black Shadow for two months. Let's go cook that up. 
Carbon paste, then we needed aluminium. Hey, the fact you need rope for cupboard, does it feel like the door or something? <laughs> like the little bit of string that lets it open and close. Um, maybe you need rope for during the making of it. The rope is to tie the handles together so whoever's stuck in it can't get out. Yes. Bit dark, but okay. A uh, copper wire. That should be enough to get started. Just need the carbon fiber. Probably need some more steel screws. Was it me who did this who filled the carpentry wrench with sticks? Like 900 wood. Uh, that would be. I filled it with sticks because we need to make lots and lots of um, stuff. Stones? I was, yeah, I was going to say, you can't uh, make anything when there's no slots for the thing to go into. No, 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 no. <laughs> it, you take. So the sticks there are to make sap from. So you grab all the sticks out and you put them in the machine at the end here, the material processor, and you get sap from it. And we get heaps and heaps of sap really quickly. The new medic bag would be ideal for Tiffany. Oh uh, yeah, true. <laughs> what, because of my tendency to die the least? I mean, if you wanted to sound as smug as you just did, sure. <laughs> Is it really that smug when I got killed last time? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it just it was just too easy an opportunity to pass that up. <laughs> so oh, hailstorm. Fantastic. Electric deep mining drill. Make. That. Oh, I guess I don't need to worry about watering these plants now. Gold wire. Oh, thanks for the prime sub, Pendragon. Okay. Might actually have enough to do with more than one of these. Do a couple of extra deep mining drills. You make sure the cupboard is well covered this time. Yes, I did. Another deep drill. Then I need copper, aluminium, and steel. Oh, Turning down the storm volume in game slightly because it um it's a bit loud. <laughs> Mine must already be down a little bit for me. Yeah. So I think I've got you guys. I'm with the overall volume down a bit for myself right now. I will not hear any critters coming. Thank you for the sub, Zingy. Yeah, is is saps from sticks or saps from wood a better ratio? I thought the wood was still a better ratio. Um, so, I mean, the sticks, which is why I went with sticks. I could be wrong, but that's why I did that. Okay, sweet. I've got enough stuff to put down two more deep mining drills. Uh, we don't have enough titanium to make a third one though. Oh, Zingy, awesome. thanks for the sub. Have yeah, taking damage while fishing. <laughs> That's the only way to fish. It's extreme fishing. Um, all right, I need my electric tool. Take two beacons. Yes. I 
wait for this storm to abate before I head out. Let's see if I can make some lights up in case some of these are in a cave. For lights. Ceiling light. Glass and iron ingots. I keep carrying my knife around because I keep thinking I still have the running bonus for it. Huh. Of course, my worry with the rifle is I'm going to accidentally fire. <laughs> right. Five lights. Let's make, let's make a few more. Why not? Yeah, so this, there will be no stream at this time next week, because that will be Christmas Day. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, so yes, there, <laughs> no stream at this time next week. Even though Shadow said we'll be back next week, we actually won't, I realised. Now that I got asked. If I hit cap, I wouldn't hurt much. I think it would if I accidentally fired a rifle at point blank range. I forgot <laughs> that it was, um... Ow! That time of the week. Dang it. No matter what game, anything with re reversible building pieces, I always get them the wrong way around. <laughs> yeah. It's like yeah, a so universal war. I lost in Valheim the other day. Even after I've been told I'd done it, I then went and did it again. <laughs> huh. There is a gold, a deep ore mining gold deposit very close to our base. Oh, neat. I think I remember that, yeah, the supports go on the inside. Ow. We don't need an actual door here, just the entrance. Like, I can literally see our wall from it. Uh, do we need gold? Probably do if we're making lots of electronics based stuff. What do we need most? Laser beams. We need iron for building our base. We're gonna need an iron deep ore deposit. We possibly want to have another copper one, but do we want to have a second copper one before we have one gold one? Yeah. Oh, there's like a mar and a boar trying to break in. Oh. Oops. I had everything live on the stream except the game sounds. Yeah. <laughs> I guess having a gold deposit makes sense. Especially when it's right outside our base. Whoa! Hey, level 2 high train, new record, amazing. Where did that go? Uh oh, why is there a million dread wings out here? <laughs> um, probably because someone left a corpse out here. Oh, I think a rabbit might have killed itself on the fence and that attracted And that attracted some... It's a good thing there isn't wolves around here, or they'd just be constantly piling up. Alright, gold deposit exploited. Now, find some iron. Uh, have we really gone through almost all of the wood reserve? Yeah. Uh, uh yeah, because I needed it for making. Oh. Oops, missed. Oops, well, missed. I suppose I could go get some more. I needed no, it for making I will some go stuff. Get some more. That's what I was created for. 
The organic resin uses up lots of it. Right, more deforestation incoming. What a delight. That's dead. I don't appreciate how heavy ah. plants are until you get a whole bunch of them. <laughs> Laws, I'm not sure that the, um... I'm not sure that the Drax would remember breakfast on Tiffany. <laughs> Thanks for the 100 bits. Uh, now I'm trying to figure out how to respond to that statement. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not sure whether you'd get the reference or not. Probably not. Something about a film. Both kind of liked it. That's the nope. one thing you got. <laughs> oh, <Yep. yeah. laughs> uh, nothing like ancient pop culture references. I know, right? Amazing hanging around Capricorns. Let's say I feel much younger than I normally do. <laughs> Found some iron ore. Hey, thanks, Reaper. Thank you for the 300 bits. Or 330. Yeah, 330. Cheaper subs for a few days and yeah. extra bits for a few days. It started like a couple of days ago. Yeah, it was from like the... 15th? I want to say like 15th to 20th. Yeah. Or like 13th to 20th or something. something that sounded like it wants to wait the beats regrown already it was like yeah. five minutes mm. oh for well, harvesting everything just takes that long there go away <laughs> now do i put one of our precious beacons down where the um gold deposit is given it's so close to our base or do i save it You wouldn't want to lose it <laughs> and then spend ages trying to find it again because we thought it was further away. Well, no, no, it's, it's within line of sight of our base, so it's so close. Like, I need yeah, to put a beacon that's... down for other things, but I'm not sure I need to put one down for that. Yeah, but knowing us, we'd find a way to lose it. Oh. This one I can't actually alter, so I'm going to pick it up. The prototype one doesn't let you alter it. Prototype, no modifications allowed. There you go, iron mine. Uh, again? More bad weather? <laughs> Flash storm. Okay. The weather is saying you will stay at base for a bit. Weather is saying you will get zapped. Go put That's some right. extra lights in the <clears throat> copper mine. And I'll go stand under a tree. And then make sure the tree is shorter than you by chopping it down. You had a hailstorm and then a thunderstorm. It's a great combo. That's fitting. Thunder hail. When exposure's going up very quickly. Uh, I'm not sure the prototype one does give a buff. I might use it to mark where our ramp is or something. Hmm, is there any tech stuff I want to unlock? And now, I guess I could use five. gold. There is an achievement for getting struck by lightning. That is a good point. Yeah, I've only got one half of that achievement. <laughs> I need to get struck again. Thank you, Reaper. Thank you again. <laughs> 550. Oh man, this stamina. Awesome.
I like how wine only ha has positive effects and beer. Hmm. Surprised that gets through the overzealous Australian senses. Well, I guess it's because of the time between consuming things that it's fine. <laughs> you can't just go absolutely insane and get drunk. Ooh, antibiotic Hello? pill is tempting with how often we go into caves and get pneumonia. Um, exotics are nice when you find them in the cave that our couple was in. Ooh. I would get the ghillie suit, but it's so far down the talent tree for survival. Under. Yeah. Hey, it's under hunting. One, two, five. Keep it a horse. Seven or eight talent points in it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my trees are on fire. Can't place the light. I mean, the 1% chance to break hasn't been that useful. This is annoying. I might actually have to build a ceiling in the cave to put lights on. Hey. Yeah. Uh, you can do like standing lights, though. Yeah, but I didn't make standing lights, did I? Oh. Hey, Ooh, we still haven't seen another spot. buffalo. Have we? Oh, another Terranus? Yeah, why not? Um, because um, we've already got a million of everything. If you remember, buffalo. you decided not to feed them until we actually are using yeah. them somewhere. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm just thinking more, if we're going to tame this one, it's going to be kind of tricky because we have to feed it without getting the rest of their attention. <laughs> I don't know, I get, it can be the juvenile mascot. Yeah, I guess you could use geodes to light places up as well. But they're, they're pretty dim lights from geodes. Not that this is actually reaching the ground even. Get work lights instead. Wait, I was here to click. Oh. Ah, the respect back in the station. Do that after. Uh, ditch that, ditch that, ditch that, ditch that. Everything's been half the street. What is Capac doing? Stacking some wood. This is where you can jump. <laughs> Much done the entire ground level in stone uh, where it can be done. Okay. Hmm, what next? Well, so I was going to suggest if you guys do want to build some sort of crazy build off the, off the side of the things, you could probably start on that. But I was going to start expanding our existing base. Oh, yeah. Uh, which way? No. I'm guessing towards the back of it? No. No? No. I will show you when I get there. Is it... But I was going to ask Kappa whether is. he would like to have the creek included as part of our base so that he can fish inside. Oh, you want to expand across the river? I do, yeah. Oh, so have like... Or is um, the base sort of split in half and then have the bridge connecting the two bits? Um, or a less horrible looking bridge in the middle of our base instead? Well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Might make keeping things from getting in by the river a bit difficult. Uh, I'll see what I can do, but oh, my I should be able on. to manage that. <laughs> We're in the food. Hey, Glenn the Sheep. Glad to distract from boring work. Best line is the chandelier from the decorations bench. I've seen that one. 
But yeah, I, I might um, remove our existing fence and put out a new one. Oh, I gotta remove the sticks away. I'm not sure Campak could be pleased if I remove it without having the other one already built. Yeah. Well, I mean, if you've got the... all the animals locked up, it should be fine. Mm. Yeah. Well, Have you got all the animals maybe... locked up? Yeah, they're all locked up. Except for the juvenile terrorist. It's just standing here. And then when you find a kind of weird lantern requires a crafting bench when I imagine what you're doing in reality is just chucking more animal fat in it. Yeah. I feel like that one should be repairable on your person. Hmm, so how big were you thinking of expanding? Um, enough space to give us room to like change up the buildings a bit, stuff like that. Like explain to those, are those flowers to the east? What are they? Now uh, let me just put this copper in the smeltery. Send off this these exotics. All right. Now, make up some more fence pieces. I've got a few that I made already. I'm not really sure how big to go. Yeah. Uh, but I do want to make things bigger. So I'm just going to start and we'll see what happens. What's the worst that can happen? We get attacked by a pack of tyrannosaurs with blazer beams. Mammoths with mounted guns. Oh, so we're playing Capac's favorite game, huh? They don't have laser guns. You sure should. I thought they did. I never seen any. If I never seen any, they don't exist. <laughs> uh, interesting. Oh, TFE. What? Your floor's sticking out the wall. Oh, yeah, it does. Didn't we have this discussion previously that, and you said, oh, well, the wall's going to change anyway, so it doesn't matter? <laughs> no, but it was like proper hovering sticking out. Um, I have no thoughts about the Barbie movie because I haven't seen it. I did see the Marvels. I've got thoughts about that. Somehow I get the impression they're not positive. <laughs> uh, they're actually mixed. Hmm. How deep in the water can I get this? I like how I said, oh, you know, the 1% chance to mine skill wasn't useful, and then it immediately triggers on the first time I go mining. <laughs> Stop the animals getting under. Yeah, I think I think the one percent chance might be too low. Because by the time you're that far through the tree, when you're mining stuff, like you've already got like tools that can mine thousands of whatever you're mining or chopping by the time it activates. Yeah. Yeah. Like you're almost incentivized to use worse tools, which I keep thinking that's not a gate anymore. <laughs> bamboozled what's not in game anymore no it's not a gate at the back oh base so i gotta go all the way around oh it's and... not on the other side of the river is this it? yeah just yeah leave that bit open i can sneak back in
Yeah, it's good work. <clears throat> hmm. I'm now wondering what the max possible weight you can carry is if you have like all the like backpacks upgrades and for extra slots and then chuck the heaviest thing into your inventory. It's gonna be quite a lot. Yeah, because I'm converting a bunch of stones into stone piles, and stone piles are actually twice as heavy as that looks stone. Nice. Come on, can we get to a thousand kilos? Despite it making no logical sense. When am I going to make proper greenhouse in a tavern? Um, probably not this stream. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm. This might create enough space for you to make a tavern. Hmm. The idea, Yay, the idea I, I had was that this would give us room to build up a bit more because we still, we're still very cramped. We don't have room to build all of the state, like the crafting benches that we need, all that sort of stuff. The character is now carrying 1,013 kilos of stuff. I think he must be very fit. Or he's just counting it as carried if it's been piled on him. Probably should be building something of a uh, building towards bu the um... ah stupid drag. I should be building towards the ramp, not building a bigger bigger corral. base. Yeah. Because there was a reason we were getting all this titanium, wasn't there? <laughs> um. It's needed to repair our weapons. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yep. It's a bit more of a priority than... Uh, giant yeah, basic tree. Well, not really. Yeah. What's happening, Kavak? The trees are trying to eat me. Of course. One of, one of the um, burnt trees was doing that scene from Austin Powers where he keeps saying, Oh, I fell over. Oh, I fell over again. Okay. Dead juvenile mower on our spikes. Oh, fantastic. Hey, my torch is on. Uh, yes, the new Aquaman movie does look... Um, what's, a, what's an appropriate word? It's a bad sign when Jason Momoa was saying it's not looking good. <laughs> Maybe disjointed is the, is the best word I could come up with for the trailer for Aquaman 2 that I saw. There was certainly a lot of things happening. That can be both good and bad. <laughs> yeah. Does anyone want to go on a mining trip? Like just for regular mining stuff? Um, nope. Sure. Once I put these plants away, I've just harvested. Is that a you're definitely not going to come back, or are you just being obnoxious? Ask if I want to, and I gave a truthful answer. 
Are you willing to? Wait, why did my crafting not work? Okay, I'm ready to go. Uh oh. Oh, you're a bit quicker than I was expecting to, eh? Because <laughs> I was trying to convince Kamak because he's the one with the cave finder. My crafting is broken. See, it wants you to go on the expedition. <laughs> yeah. I may have to reconnect. Thank you for the follow, Brandon Norad. I got wood piles in my crafting queue, but they're not crafting and I can't cancel the queue. Are your slots filled up so they can't craft? No. No, I've got plenty of room. Oh, level it's 26. Just, like, I've got no progress on the crafting thing. Like, it's not ticking down or anything. Oh, yeah. You may hmm. need to reconnect it for that, looks like. No, not had it ever do that before. It's most unusual. Hmm. hmm. Do you think it'd be worth me going down to get the ghillie armor? So it looks pretty good. Uh, that requires, like, fancy stuff, doesn't it? Um, no, it actually requires really cheap stuff, but I have to go down one of the talent trees to unlock it. Red wing. Uh, the ghillie armor is just fibre sticks and rope. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was tossing up whether I would unlock obsidian or unlock composite chest, um, armors. <coughs> Which if I can get, we will probably all just switch over to. It's just whether we want a set bonus of explosive resistance and volcanic exposure resistance, or whether we want a set bonus of 30% health regen and 30% stamina regen. And mm. um, what else could I put points into? So oh, like a that's for another drought. Oh, chance to craft double ammo. That is true that the ghillie suit armor reduces threat, but I think it makes stealth. Better. Yeah, the ghillie suit has quite good temperature resistance. Yeah, and reduces your threat a lot. Do whatever you like, TFA. Yep. Take the capac approach. Find a whim, do it. If there's a whim, there's a way. Oh, wait, there's increased inventory weight capacity on the adventure. I didn't realize. I only done the um, resources ones. I'll just do a solid first, even though it does nothing. River counters of water source for Thames? No. Oh, that was another thing I was meaning to say to TFP. You should get rid of the, um, the troughs that are outside. Wait, there's ones outside? <clears throat> there are ones that are outdoors, yes. Didn't notice them. <laughs> They're near the main building like you should rip those up so that the animals only go to the ones that are inside the barn because it'll make them much easier to control then i just end up taking the lazy option just picking more health <laughs> yes that is All true that uh sin boogie ow the dc has an amazing um their like animation setup it's great and marvels are rubbish but Marvel does better live-action films. Or at least they did. We'll see how it goes with James Gunn actually being in control now. Repairs before I have to pick things up. Thanks, Talking Beans. Thanks for 14 months. Uh, oh, the trots are here. I'm going all right. And at least I'm getting better from my COVID. Unfortunately, Toby's sick now, but hopefully he'll be better soon. Hopefully he'll do that 
thing that kids do and bounce quickly. So unfair. All these diseases going around. Yeah. About to go make a whole lot more fences and I'm like I probably don't want to waste all our resources making a ton of these fences when then we're gonna have extras ex excess less oh my gosh I can't speak well, extras left over because of taking down the ones that are existing uh, I went and hung out with some friends on uh, Saturday night and they have like a, a preschool aged child. And oh, all of so their you're stories... going to get something weird now. Uh, well, I don't hang out with them that often. But all of their stories sound like the plagues of Nurgle. Yeah. I will not fall to the corruption. Oh, no, don't do that. Pick you. Um, so, with all this wood that I'm chopping, I've been putting the, the frosty wood I've been collecting in this cabinet over here. Yep, it's good for fuel. Yeah, it's good for burning because it lasts twice as long. And then I'm just making the wood stacks out of the regular wood. Oh, don't worry, I'm expecting Toby to bring home all sorts of plagues uh, once he goes to daycare next year. Uh, TFE, there's a hole mm. in your barn. What? Oh no, the it barn hole. Four. It's because you were relying on the fence being the wall and I just removed the fence. Well... So I was just telling you, there's a hole in your wall. Ow. <laughs> Light might be nice. Yeah. What? Oh, the drink just gave me a level up. Oh, I want to level up. Nurgle could learn a thing or two from the precious snot goblins. Yeah, probably. Uh, Look, when you animals. think you're staring at something to pick it up and you're actually not. Not from an expansion. I mean, it seems like the animals have very little interest in escaping anyway. Yeah, but you, you, it's not about the esca escapees, it's about the ones coming in. Oh, yes. <laughs> These gates keep out, not keep in. Uh, my axe might need some repair. Can I repair it here? Yes. Down a bit. I like it that tall. Drop you? No. Well, fine. Be that way. <laughs> As I say, I've got the saying oh. on where you can see oh, where other people are trying to place stuff. So it looks really fine with you spinning it around. <laughs> yeah, I usually leave that setting on too because it's, it's quite handy being able to see. Especially when you're trying to demonstrate something. Oh, yeah. I just had a great idea. Why do you sound so surprised? <laughs> wow. <laughs> the way he said it is like... <laughs> hey, yeah, TFE, I'm with you. I'm with you. If I change my phone notifications to just recordings of myself, it splits you won't know when my phone's <laughs> going off during a stream. Yeah, you could do that. We'll just be like, Capac, why are you talking about the same thing over and over? I wonder how much grief people at work will give you for 
putting yourself as your own phone notification though. Eh, I don't think I find it that much different than my usual shenanigans at work. Uh, eh. There's too many watermelons in this oven. <laughs> okay, that, that needs to be a... <laughs> what? Like, what? What are you doing? And why are you cooking prime meat? Why not? Because it's better if you put it on to cure and dry. Because what? then it gives a different Boring. buff. And we've got proper cooked food for cooked food buffs, so... Why are you even messing around with that at all? Where do we even... Because I'm going to put stuff in places and they're all full. Yeah, why do you think I'm making our base bigger? So we'll have room to store more stuff and make some actual storage. That, that has absolutely no bearing on what I'm doing. Yes, it does, because instead of storing stuff in the kitchen block, we can store stuff in a cupboard next to the kitchen block or a fridge. Or even better yet, a deep freeze. Which has absolutely no impact on me attempting to put things away now. It does. Because <laughs> you <laughs> have a hope for the future. Oh, right. Okay. You're just oh, such a pessimist, you can't there's, see it. There's not enough room for me to put these watermelons. Let me see if I've got some hope for the future of storage. Yeah, exactly. See, you're getting it now. It's like when I, when I go to put a book down and I'm like, oh no, well, I've run out of bookshelf. Ah, oh, I'll just think about potentially patching bookshelves at Ikea. Exactly, it makes you feel better. No, it doesn't. Also, can we sleep? I'm no. doing this in the dark. I'm too disturbed by this conversation to sleep. I turn on this fire and make it nice and comfy and warm in here. Oh no. Also, why did you choose the one full thing to try and cook in when you can cook the things just as fast in so many other places? You Don't can. bring logic into it. <sighs> Chill. <laughs> Chill AAA is saying that he might play Mass Effect. It's dangerous territory. Depends on which one, in Capac's opinion, anyway. The first one. Ignore all others. Ooh, am I about to say something controversial? <laughs> I, I know that they're, they're... The third one, if we ignore, like, the last 15 minutes. <laughs> the... There are some good things about 2 and 3, but in my opinion, they don't make up for the things that drag them down. Uh, Alright, what do I want to do now? I, I think the thing food. with one is if you want to do like 100%, it is insanely tedious. Yeah, you pretty much have to play through the game like three times to 100% it, if I recall correctly. Yeah, I think it I think it did. It took you like 50, 60 something hours. When if you play through the game quickly, you can do it in like 20. This is why I never bothered 100% any game. Oh, what I normally do is, when a game first comes out, I will basically play it in story mode, pretty much blind, rush through it as quickly as possible, and then on my second playthrough, I'll do like a do everything. Um, which is hilarious, the amount of stuff I missed in Baldur's Gate 3, and I was horrifically underleveled for most of it. <laughs> uh... Come back, I got a little fishing spot for you. But you've dammed the river. No, 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 I'm, I'm not that good a builder. There's definitely ability for stuff to flow through there. Uh -huh. Alright, let me fish this drack. Um, it's not a problem I've got the iron sledgehammer now. I just noticed no one was using it, so I picked it up. As soon as come across a lot of those rocks. Oh, I just didn't it. care about the stuff that they contained. Yeah. Uh, I genuinely don't care about it because it's um, mostly stuff that's kind of occupying inventory space. I really wish it wasn't. 
Until we have lava base of evil. There, there are there have been some times recently where the amount of different inventory items here on yeah um, over here are making me feel a bit Ravenhursty. Not, not in a good way. I'm seeing people saying some very correct things about the Mass Effect series and some very incorrect things about the Mass Effect series. Why are you all doing this to Capac? And why, actually, why are you all doing this to me? What did I do to can. deserve Capac whinging about this stuff again? This is usually what happens for an AA recording. Me and Capac end up talking about this sort of thing for 20 minutes. Oh, my train of thought has been entirely derailed. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> this is what happens when somebody says that Mass Effect 2 has a more nuanced story than Mass Effect 1. Uh, uh, I can theoretically understand what they mean. <laughs> <laughs> the problem with 2 is it's not really connected to 1 and 3's story all that much. Uh, I barely okay, remember the stories at all. Yeah, it's like, congratulations, you've delayed them by, what was it, six months, a year? But the thing <laughs> the thing that 2 had going for it was the individual stories for the individual characters. Yeah, the characters, the, the overall... Life. That was the best part of Mass Effect 2. Plus, it didn't kind of help for 3 that they had to work around potentially a whole load of characters, you know, being dead. The, the overall story of Mass Effect 2 effectively being, ooh, it's a big mystery, what's happening? Oh, it was the guys from the first one. <laughs> was not particularly great. I mean, it's literally the first mission where it's revealed. It's, I, it's not even built up as a big mystery. Anyway. Yes, anyway. I have almost completed right. our new corral. We'll talk about more modern games with terrible stories. What, you're going to talk about Andromeda? <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I can't actually talk about the story in Andromeda because I, I have not played it and I've not followed and anyone no who's and reported no on it to find out about it. Yes, I'm probably the only person you know who's played it. <laughs> like, even, even the people that back in the Mass Effect days that I was watching their stuff and were tearing all the silly stuff that was happening in Mass Effect 2 and 3 to pieces. Like, even they didn't, like, do videos on Andromeda because they'd given up at that point. Yeah. The only thing I remember about Andromeda was something, something animations? Oh, the facial animations. Yeah, yeah that was the, the big meme. And how all sorry except it. for one had exactly the same face. Oh no, Chile, eh? we can't. No, Quebec thinks Mass Effect is bad. That is worse. <laughs> Halo what? TV series. Oh, <laughs> I looked over and all I saw Chile talking about was the Icarus story. I'm like, the Icarus story movies are actually pretty good. Um, it's because yeah, they're in my chat as well. Um, but. Have you guys seen the... watched the Icarus ones? Uh, no, I, I think not. I might have watched something very early, like back in the beta yeah. days, but I haven't... The, haven't since then. There's been a little bit more since then, but not much. Um, but yeah, that they, they were really well done. Solid acting... The, like... Like, a game like Icarus, I'm not looking for, like... Yeah. Story. story and lore in like a it's survival type background. game the, the stories are the ones that you make for yourself like yeah. it's like it's like saying you don't like the the canon lore for rimworld it's like and who cares yeah the, the story of rimworld is 
oh, I had this colony, and then a bunch of robots showed up and set the uh, clan leader on fire. Mm. It's like why there'd never be like a Mass Effect TV series or movie. It's because there would just be constant arguments over, oh, this is canon now, or this isn't canon. I mean, that already happens, and it's a game where you can make your own choices. Well, hey, <laughs> Halo figured out the trick to that. You just make... You Everyone. Just, you just make everything so bad that it, it can't even be associated with canon. So you can't even have those arguments. The story. Ah, uh, jeez. Anyway. Yes, Nothing of you two griping about stories. Hey, I'm Never. not griping. Capac's griping. Only griping. I, am a I mean, that is what you're here for, Capac, because you do just whinge. Wow. For me to complain about a story, it has to be spectacularly bad. Like, I have a very high tolerance level for, let's say, mediocre. Hence <laughs> the need for speed games. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <clears throat> so TFE, a couple of things yeah. I was thinking with the new way this corral is sorted out. One, let's not pave the entire area. Ow. <laughs> <laughs> let's try and make it so that it looks like there are some pathways. We're going to make a more open plan. Oh yeah, that's good. Um, and then you obviously will pave wherever you're going to put down the farms, or you can put down the farms the way that I did, which was directly on the that was. ground. Um, but if you're wanting little crop plots for more stuff. Actually, for the crop plots, I could do like a little terrace, like sort of raised thing. Ah! Bird attack! Yep. Whoever just fired a gun in the base is very brave. Or Why? trying to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. I killed the bird. I got the kill. Hmm. How did it get in? I thought everything because was walled holes up. There's everywhere. Now. Well, no, probably it's, in between. It's enclosed now. Um, uh, but I'm going to put more... The base may be big enough that it spawned inside. Oh. Yeah, probably. Uh, but I'm, that's why I'm going to make more of the deterrence. deterrent thingies. Yeah. Once I remember where you make them. Because I can't remember. <laughs> Does anyone remember? Uh, people in the <laughs> chat getting a conversation about Andromeda confused between Mass Effect Andromeda oh, and and Gene Roddenberry <laughs> Andromeda yeah. TV show. The 2017 game. Which does not feel like almost seven years ago. You know, I've actually never seen the Andromeda TV show. I should probably check it out at some point. The Tarrant things. Uh, is it maybe something you just make in your suit? All right, like I can't even find it in the tech tree. <laughs> I, was, yeah. I was just going to ask use if anyone tree. in the chat has um, seen it and can uh, say whether it's any good or not. And Dominator said, "Don't bother." Textiles. Uh, bench. Yeah, it was Kevin. Kevin Sorbo. Advanced I think. creature deterrent tier three at the top. Cloth head armor, cloth arm armor. So I need to unlock those as well. Fibers. We have spare crop pots. I don't know, I must have used them. Probably. Um, we're also a little on the um, low side for sulfur, and sulfur should probably go. Like, you're gonna have to go out and collect a bunch. Because we yeah. need more for gunpowder anyway. Unless I remember you liking the fertilizer is... to gunpowder. Oh, was that useful for something that's crafting really quickly? Yes. I am clearing out some of the piles of sticks that put into the chest that should be converted into sap instead. I remember liking Hercules, but I don't remember much about it. And Farscape is quite good. Yes. Thanks, Funk Overload. Thanks for the Prime sub 20 minutes ago that I missed. And thank you, Fabian. Thank you for three years. Actually, I watched um, 
Uh, they used to be called Toy Galaxy, but I think they're called Secret Galaxy now. They did a video about, um, like, Farscape. Talking about the series development and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And what I found very interesting was they got kicked off all of their sets after the first season. <laughs> because Attack of the Clones started filming. Oh. And they needed all of the sound stages, so... Did chest instead of arm. Basket had to move. <clears throat> and that almost killed them after season one. Uh, ignore the big stone block I'm building, I'm just testing something. That's extremely temporary. <laughs> <laughs> Thoughts on the old Asterix and Oblix movies? <clears throat> I think I've tried to watch some of them at some point and I wasn't very keen on any of them that I saw. I prefer the old, just the comics. I think you could potentially do a pretty good Asterix and Oblix, but I haven't seen any of them that I've liked that much. Hey, hey, why are you building a massive cube? Yeah, it's not gonna stay. Build the cube! Build the cube! Probably you end up using half pieces for it, maybe even shorter. You're gonna have to explain what you're trying to do, because I don't think half pieces mm. are gonna solve your problem. Yeah. I'm basically thinking of a way to do, like, the crop plots on, like, a little raised thing. Obviously not this high. Oh. Um, <laughs> okay, so TFE, you're doing it all wrong. Um, let me show you. Like, this is literally as wrong as you could go, uh, because you've started in the wrong point. So when you're building stone frames, instead of snapping to terrain, you should be using the page up and page down keys to just build it barely above the ground height, like that. See? Then you don't even need a ramp. Mm. Then, then you can make it look like a nice little garden. Put a few of them next to each other. Um, and here, have your bits back. So press page up, page down. Uh, no, you gotta press end anything. to not lock. Not be locked. And that just disappears. What? Hmm. I can look at this, press end. Pick up just... that. No, end. Yeah. Yeah, Does, doesn't it unlock? Stop oh, snapping to it, things. No, that's the thing. I'm not. <laughs> yeah, see now, now. Pr oh, it just disappeared on its own. What? So when you're looking like oh, now, now yes. I've got it. Why is yeah. it so janky <laughs> for me? Because uh, you kept snapping to things. I think. The um. Yes, I did not know they existed. <laughs> yeah. So that's a much better way of doing what you were trying to do. Yeah. And it means you can place them down. Care If you're careful about it, you can place them down near a building and just a little bit raised, and then you put your floor on it, and then you can put your plant mm. your plant plots on it, and then you've got nice little raised plots. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah ben? You, you do not want to be building at full cube size. No. <laughs> that oh, is horrific. Full cube. Full cube. That's, that's a level of ugly that I'm it. just... No. No. Can't, I can't deal. I want more cubes. Also, can I give you your cubes back, TFP? Um, sure. Um, yes, Ben Browder and Cordia Black were a great combination. But I think in Stargate they kind of kept them apart a bit because they, did, <laughs> they didn't want to invite too many comparisons to Farscape. My chat wants three-story gardens. Yes, we're going to do the Hanging Gardens of Babylon <laughs> in Icarus. Uh, should be able to put these by this gate. Raised guns of Prometheus, yes. <laughs> Is TFE a Borg drone? Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Would explain a lot. 
Well, I haven't... I haven't seen. seen any pictures of him that show any uh, cybernetic bits yeah. coming off him. Oh, somebody's getting swooped. But that, that isn't proof I'm not. Not sure how you would prove that, that negative. I just unlock some new building stuff with all my extra tech points. Farscape, Firefly, Stargate, top three sci fi. Uh, Farscape, Stargate, Futurama. That's my top three. Uh. Hmm. Top sci fi. Well, it's always difficult though, because when you're asked to rank them off the top of your head, and then when you're asked to give reasons, you tend to change your mind. <laughs> I'm set on those three. I mean, oh, same it, when Bo just been here. For? It depends what you mean by sci-fi. Yeah, can we put in Star Wars: The Clone Wars? <laughs> um. Well, see, like the Clone Wars, I wouldn't put. Like, if you're going for like a strict definition of sci-fi. I would say would the Clone Wars isn't as good because the Clone Clone Wars is more like of like a character and sort of war stories and stuff like that, and less like science fiction ideas that people have to deal with. Yeah. Generally in sci-fi, there's humans. Like if you if you're looking at it in terms of like number of weird sci-fi ideas that are presented and dealt with and have to be figured out, kind of thing, then stuff like Star Trek The Next Generation, Stargate, uh, Futurama are definitely up there because they're like they're pretty much dealing with new crazy sci-fi things every episode. <laughs> but then you have like some sci-fi shows that are only dealing with like one sci-fi idea and they repeat it like over and over again like Quantum Leap or Sliders. Yeah, I I guess you're you're taking a very different approach than I was with what you're thinking there. Um, I was just literally thinking shows that can be defined as sci-fi that are really good. Yeah, that's it. But Keep those, it nice and simple. But the ones that you chose are also three good examples of. Shows that have a lot of sci-fi. Yeah. So they're good sci-fi shows. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, I'm not sure what I think. Like, the Orville isn't in the top three for me, but it is certainly one that Ooh. I very much enjoyed. Yeah, the Orville's, Orville's a strong contender. Yeah, it doesn't look like... The Orville is the closest I've come to watching Stargate. I mean, Star Trek. <laughs> doesn't look like Scoria has a um, discount cost talent, whereas Stone Buildables do. Yep. Annoying. None of the new ones seem to. Like, um, Farscape and Futurama, I would say both have stronger characterization than a lot of these other shows like Orville and Star Trek. Yeah, I'd agree with that. But Orville and Star Trek tend to go a bit deeper into the uh, nuts and bolts of some of the sci-fi concepts. Yeah. Whereas Futurama and Farscape, because they're more of a comedic bent, they can Gloss uh, over hand wave with happily. comedy so, yes. some things that other shows might get uh, might have to spend more time explaining. Yeah, I think that's fair. I feel like we've got enough wood for now. You think? Have you put any of it in the cupboard? Yeah. Oh wow. I was almost put full. All the frozen wood. Yeah, frozen yeah. Wood. Oh. 
All the plants burn again. <laughs> Walkways. Why is there a chair in the river? Uh, because Capac. <laughs> yeah, that's my fishing chair. I think there isn't tides, so it could just... Yeah, it is a bit of a shame that the Orville is probably done. Or almost certainly done. There are... There are a lot of stories of, um, shows almost or being ended because of various Hollywood strikes. Look, Disney are too busy making so many quality products so they just don't have the time or the resources to contribute. Here we go again. To a well-regarded <laughs> sci-fi series. Yep. Correctly, there's something within like Cana Canadian animation, the reason that shows always ends at 52 episodes. Uh, I think 52 is uh, like an American syndication number. Or something, yeah. Yeah, it's really annoying with it. I'm trying to think it's like, probably like four or five series I watched when I was a kid that ended on a cliffhanger because that got in the way. <laughs> huh. <Yeah>. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's something that's always baffled me is this like, like back when everything was like television and they'd be like, all right, we need, we need 22 episodes of this show and we're going to put on one episode every week. And, and so you need to make that many and come in on budget. And it's like, can't we just make half that number and you can run it twice since you're going to put it on reruns anyway? Um, like the hmm. chances are, like back then, like a lot of people are going to miss it on the first run. Yeah. Yeah, and you didn't really have much recourse if you missed it back then. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Especially if it was like the situation over here where the TV channels, if it was slightly underperforming, they'd just push it into a later and later time slot until you're to having to it. stay up until 1.30 in the morning to watch episode nine of the series you've been trying to follow for the past month yeah they're yeah. basically trying to kill it slowly oh look it's underperforming it's like well yeah you're broadcasting at like 3 a.m <laughs> the lower numbers of this show we put on at 10 30 prove yeah. that it's not as popular um isn't this something we use spoiled plants for uh you can use them in the composter make fertilizer for the plants but i don't think anybody's got any of the composter stuff yet no yeah. i was hoping tfe might go down that road because hmm. the then he might also go down the talent tree to allow himself to make gunpowder from fertilizer yeah that was pretty handy it was super it is handy. A composter i could have sworn it was outside somewhere i don't i don't think we've even got one yet but we did before i don't know Oh, Scrat, thanks for the sub. Ooh, that's a bit weird. Eh, it'll be fine. Yes, indeed. The Network wanted a space western rather than the original Star Trek. And then 30 years later, we got an actual space western and it was cancelled. Okay. I've expanded the boundaries of our base considerably. I've now got to decide how we're going to rearrange the buildings so that they make more sense in it and we can fit more stuff in. It's a more difficult thing to figure out than I 
anticipate it. <laughs> oh, that's that's another thing that's always confused me. The TV networks is randomly playing things in the wrong order for no reason. Huh. Or TV series are in weird chronological orders for no apparent reason. Or TV series like Futurama that don't have a proper proper order? Does that uh, make sense? I mean It sort of does though. I mean I my proper order that I use is the DVD order. It gets even more convoluted though when you know a series isn't in chronological order and then something happens that makes you think, oh, that must be from chronology before. And it's like, well, no, <laughs> they actually have some other convoluted explanation as to why this character is still around. <laughs> it's an evil clone. And yeah, what is the composter called that does just fertilizer? I found the biofuel one, the texture, but I don't see the other one. Ah, oh, wood composter. There it is. Cool. Go. Well, we've got more walkways than we had previously, but I'm still probably not going to end up with walkways all the way around. Largely because I'm going to lose interest before I get that far. Yeah, shot myself in the gate. What? You, you shot heard yourself me? into the gate. <laughs> I shot myself in the gate. I didn't know you had a gate. Is there a goat carcass here. You don't ask these sort of questions. <laughs> Actually, I don't think it was any of you guys. I think it might have been the. Ran into motorbirds. spikes. Too high? What? Um. Thanks, forty percent, Zig. Thank you for the prime sub. Hmm. Appearing to be unable to place the spikes where I want to place them. too hot. <laughs> that looks very wrong. Ooh, I'm almost at level 35. Oh, nice. Uh, how are we doing for stone? Do we need more stone? Uh, I don't Perfect. think so. You know, you could, you know, unlock the ability to make some pieces and then you could start building your base if you wanted, rather than just resource collecting all the time if you don't want to do that. Except I can't because I don't have any talent points. Do I need to level up? Why do you need talent points? You just need blueprint points. Or do you not even have any of them? Yeah. Oh. They're all oh. gone. I see. Alright. Oh, oxide. TFE, will you be upset if I make a new barn for you? No. Cool. I mean, what's wrong with the current Sorry. one, though? <laughs> um, location and why is my ground glitching? Oh, well, actually, that's something I could do. It's pretty dig too deep. Ah, a Balrog. Hmm. Let's have a look. Oh, Splits is using photo mode. <laughs> yeah, I want to get a aerial view of our Can't base. Can't see my axe. <laughs> to get an idea. Ah, of what the? I'm, the I'm just perm I'm permanently pixelated now. It's fine. <laughs> what have you done to all the animals? 
Hmm. Oh, right. I forgot. I don't even have an animal. You don't? I, don't I thought I you had spares. I got killed last time, didn't Yeah, but I? I thought you had spares, though. I don't think I've... Oh. No, I got this one. Um, that, I, that I can't get out. Hmm. Because all the animals have decided they're just going to stand right at the door. Yeah, use the other <laughs> entrance. <laughs> that, that doesn't help. Yes, it does. And if that entrance doesn't work, use the other other entrance. <laughs> My my mower is stuck in between all the other animals and they won't move out of the way. Makes sense. You go over here. <laughs> you go over here. This is like one of those games where you have to slide the cars around to get one out of the parking lot. <laughs> yep. Yep. I think what I'll do, start by moving the barn because it's a mess. Hey! Don't know what TFB was thinking with some of the wall pieces that he's put down, but that's okay, he's learning. Hmm. Where are my grenades? <laughs> <laughs> uh, where's my, my canteen gone? Now, TFE, most of the reasons for moving the um, the barn is to give it more room, and also, mm -hmm. and then have more room so that it can have more entrances and easier access. Yes, not like having to fight through three different doors. Yes, because we do everything to appease Capac. You should. And it's our lot in this life, TFE. Oh, yeah. just remembered something I need to make sure I've queued up tons of. How's it going? Six. I need more. I need more silica and more stone. Yeah, come back. We're going to need heaps more stone. Well, too late. I've already decided I'm doing something else. What are you doing? I'm going to go hunting for some sulfur. Ah, cool. Explosives, I like. Wait, so there's a town that allows bullet crafting from fertilizer? Mm -hmm. Yep. Oh, uh, what's Gunpowder. it called? Crafting from it. What uh, category is it under? Just so I can see what I'd have to farming? get it. Yeah, it's on the farming tree somewhere. Yeah, I'm. Oh, there. I don't remember where it is. One, two, yeah, it's cooking farming on the right, like halfway down the tree. Oh, yeah. Shoot the breeze. Grants the recipe to make gunpowder from fertilizer on the mortar and pestle. Yeah, I started getting down the farming tree to access that as well, but I was also doing it because I wanted to get the get up and go increase to base stamina. Let's go put down a some sort of foundation for this thing. Basically, I realized if we were going to be trying to build something up into the 
up onto the cliffside, we are just never going to get it started. It's going to be so long before we get to that yeah. point. That we needed a bigger base here before then. Looks so weird having the bridge without all the walls on it. Uh, more reason why they're called mower in this and reach. Well, mower real animals. Um, and I presume the mower in this are uh, like recreated yeah. earth mowers. Um, but I think the mowers in Reach are just native bird-like animals to the planet Reach that were named after mowers. Uh, don't know if they've actually gone into detail on it in the Halo lore, but they could potentially be... Oh, what the? Ah! What's happening? Uh, a baby bear just attacked me. Wait, what? what? I thought they were it... missions only. Yeah, I thought they were like those base defending ones. Well, one just tried to eat me. That's truly bizarre. Ah! Stupid geezer. Oh, can we can we do the vapor condenser? Yeah. What do you want from it? <clears throat> well, we could get exotics from it. Yeah, I mean. Oh, there's a coal deposit over here in this crater as well. Yeah, we're not really worried about coal at the moment, thankfully. We'll need to do some collecting of um, some of the materials around the place soon, though. Nice door opening seal. Yes, it only took me three attempts to open the door. Uh, yeah, so Halo Law. So it's. I don't know if they've really mentioned it anywhere, but it's. It is possible that the mower on Reach are actual mower that were actually like transplanted there from Earth at some point in the past. Let's see. A weird roaring sound. Are you near a waterfall of some sort? Oh, uh, what is that? Oh, okay. I think that's why there was a bear cub. You find a bear cave or something? Uh, I think there's a bear here in the crater. Oh. Oh, and it's chasing me. work. I think that'll be big enough uh, in the middle of the floor. I might need some help. <laughs> oh, what? are you coming home? Where are you? Oh, ah, no, you're a horse, not a bear. <laughs> Slight difference. Uh, I think I lost a bear, but there was a horse chasing me. <laughs> I was trying to bear? lure the bear back. Yeah, let's go fight the bear. Um, I'm down for a bear.
Why so many doors? Because Capac just complained before about not being able to get in or out of the barn. So yeah. lots of doors. Oh, the barn doors. Just every bit of wall is a door. Uh, I'd say the bear anyway. Yeah, middle of the night. Best time to hunt bears. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, they won't be expecting it. They'll be busy sleeping. Slightly off course. There should have been more this way. Seriously, where are you going? I ran into a bear at the crater. Yeah. Where's the crater at? I don't know. I've kind of gotten lost in the dark. Uh, oh no, here's bear the has escaped. Yeah, I think the bear's gone. Really again? It's lag that these gates are quite to get through. That's some of your Starlink lag. Uh, or maybe that's just I've had bad internet for so long. That's become my default excuse even after getting Starlink. <laughs> <laughs> Right, time to level up. You just abandoned me in the bear. Yeah. Yeah, he did. Oh, I guess I'll go and join Splitsy then. <laughs> I am abandoning you to the bear that wasn't there. Wait, I repaired, I repaired my torch. Why is it empty? It did not work. How did you not take it off your hotbar? Ah, oh, that's probably why. Well, good luck, Splitsy. I'll be fine. I think chat's going to be more concerned or hoping for the storm at this point. Than a bear. Oh, bikes. I nearly ran into because I couldn't see them. Well, I've got a couple of stacks of sulfur. I guess I'll um, pick up some iron on my way back. Must be a good amount of stuff around here, but the woodwall fortifications are popping in quite badly. <laughs> Must be because I'm having to use my lantern to see. Magic! Uh, Alright, let's spend some points. And the lights don't work for the spikes at all. Talent points. Probably turn off your torch, can I? Combat. Oh yeah, I could do that. Uh, there's the door. <laughs> uh, less wear rates. Just bullet spread. The um, yeah. the new corral has three entrances, TFA. Oh, it's way less. Oh, the move speed. Ah, I don't want the move speed. Yeah, I'll start moving towards that. Yeah, sadly, individual stalls for the animals doesn't really work because of the way the feeding troughs attract them. Mm -hmm. Uh, tech tree, what do I want? Got the advanced alteration bench. <clears throat> yeah, so if you repair them without taking them out of the heart, it go it uses the animal fat, but then... Yeah, yeah. Like it's now. bugged. It's been bugged for months now? Oh, I needed the chemistry bench to do that miasmic stuff. Oh, yeah. On the chemistry bench. If it needs titanium, you're going to have to wait. It needs steel, refined wood, electronics, composites, and glass. Oh, composites, yeah. What about tier three? <clears throat> I suppose I could repair my armor. Uh, more ammo types. It 
tree just hit me. What? You heard me. What, what it fell on you? Yeah. Ooh. Something was pushing against me. Surprise attack. Yeah. Ah, the joys of eating proper food. Do not have to worry about storm exposure. And yeah, like I've got, I've got, what, 875 health. <laughs> yeah. So are you trying to make the same foods that I was making, or have you found some um, better ones? Um, yeah, I've been trying to. Hopefully, hopefully with the three animal deterrents we've got uh, on the base, we should have fewer things ending up on the spikes, destroying our walls. Can right. somebody e take this anvil? I just found eight iron ingots on the ground. Uh, Thanks, let's anvil. make Patriot. Oh. The one next to the forge. Who would have taken it? was an it? anvil. Who would have taken it? Well, maybe it was destroyed by the weather then. I don't know. I just picked up an overflow bag. Yeah, I'm... Expecting TFE to have a quick look at his inventory and see if he's got it. No. Nope. Well, why yeah. would I do that? I used the anvil oh, inside. <laughs> I stuck it out there because I thought, oh yeah, decorative. This looks nice. What kind of walls do you want? Need more stuff. I have the cheaper crafting. Oh, I need more tree Oh, sound. yeah. I just, uh, just figured you just were not... doing stuff. Yeah, not really at the moment. <laughs> um, yeah, need... Need more walls, I need more roofs, I need more floors. Or everything. Get the scoria out of there because it's annoying. We've already got 18 floors. Uh, yeah, that's we'll a wall. probably have extra floors left over when we tear up some of the ones that are down around the place. More iron nails. Um, ice cream, the open windows don't cause damage anymore. They used to back in the beta, but they don't cause damage anymore. Uh, so you don't have to go around closing up your base. Good. I don't Deco. know where my lantern is. Uh, it used to be a thing, but it yeah, it hasn't been a thing for quite some time. Okay, I can make well up to thirty six more walls. So I'm guessing I'll just make like twenty. Yeah, twenty be good. Oh, this takes so long. And then oh, we've already got 18 floor, some, uh, some roof. Uh, there you go, Talus. Nope. Uh, yeah, Tomaso, I've used the replace option with the repair hammer before. It's very useful. Nope. It can be, but I... I mean, in this playthrough, I, we haven't really replaced any, many buildings. I did replace this, the wood with Ooh, stone so just when wait. we first did it, and I used the replace mode then. Oh, someone reminded me to up. use it, because I'd forgotten. Uh, but... Yeah, as I said, I haven't needed to use it much in this particular save. Uh, should we sleep until the morning? Yes. yes. Doesn't sound like he's sleeping. <laughs> I'm on my way back. 
MJ Gosh. Okay, Come before on. I went to the morning, time briefly went backwards. I went from 107 to 106. <laughs> oh, that's what you want. Only concerning. MJ uh, Gosh yeah, yeah, couldn't ship his back. favorite brand of biltong to me. Uh, what brand was it? I could see if it's available locally. Uh, TFE, can you make me some sure. stonewall angles? Well, since I can't get out the gate again. Ooh, um, just five <laughs> more to go. So and then long. some more stone half pitches as well. Uh, so angled and then half pitches. Oh, okay, we can so like 15. Bucks. Are the angled bits maybe make like eight? Yeah. Um, and the half bits, I don't know, six? Yeah. Uh, I guess while we wait for that, we'll go get some more sulfur. Wait, it's just paused? Hang on. Silica. So far. And then if you can make um, like 40 odd um, posts as well. What was that? You just cut out for a second. Uh, 40 odd posts. Oh, posts. Stone beams. Stone, stone beams. Oh jeez, I can, geez, I can make 81. I don't need that many. <laughs> Why are there so many trees falling over over here? Oh, those storms. It's been one hell of a storm. I mean, it's gonna take about a minute to craft. I might go and find some more stuff. I made it out the gate the first time. Yay! Now, I do like that. I like that they've given well, us the ability to use the half walls on top as well, rather than just bottom. So many different things can be done with roofs now. Well, yeah, the half floor piece is good for doing um, a bridge, because you can center it relative to the thing it's attached to. Okay. Actually, I should probably test out the sledgehammer on some wildlife because it stats look pretty good. <laughs> wow. Somebody called the RSPCA. I mean, you say like me using a spear that sets them on fire isn't pretty bad as well. True. No, I've I've left the RTX voice stuff on, but it shouldn't be impacting TFE because that's it's not the RTX voice stuff is just working for you guys in chat. They should still hear the crickets. Um, yes, and we Cicada get to is this. coming through loud and clear. Uh, yeah, he's I'm only inflicting it on There's, us. There aren't any at the moment. And our strings. Well, if I don't, then TFE whinges that my volume constantly changes, and then he... exactly. Like that. Bam, 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 bam. I learned from the best. <laughs> so I've lofted the ceiling for the uh, barn. Memphis because... or Chattanooga? Flaming spear, you mean self cooking kebab skewer? Yes. <laughs> Otherwise. We were going to be... Because it should make it easier for us to get on and off the animals if we don't get clipped into the ceiling. Oh yeah, Capac, you could use the as your phone notification. Ooh.
Right, and I use the as um an unknown caller. I <laughs> did you just play that or do that? I just did that. Oh, that's a good one. It sounded just like it. Oh. Interesting. A few more. Oh, I'll come back. Hey. Find oh, one of those 90s services, know. like late 90s, early 2000s services where you can sell your ringtones to other people. Actually, something like that's probably available through Cameo. That's quite the barn the Amish would be jealous. Yes! That is the goal of every barn builder. Okay, uh, I have made a repairing station. Yeah, what's the deal with those? So, uh, it can repair any equipment from any kind of bench, as long as the right materials to repair stuff are in it. Okay. And well, it can so even you... repair your armor while it's still on you, you don't have to take it off or anything. Wait, so you could, how much does it weigh? Could you like carry it with you? Uh, you I go out? don't think... Oh, oh, that's a fair question. Maybe. But you need to carry all the materials to do the yeah. repairs. Yeah, yourself. but if we can carry it, we can then have carry the materials for repairing, say, our rifles. Uh, possibly. Possibly. Like what I'm doing, which is preparing a second rifle. Uh, it may need shelter to operate, though. So it might need to be in a cave or something if we do it in the field. Yeah. I mean, Spitz is usually carrying, what, the aluminium shed? When we go on longer quests, yeah. Repair bench also needs power. Ah. No, no. It only needs power for tier 4 equipment. For anything okay. below that, it doesn't need a connection. Wait, you just bring a water um, thing with you. Unfortunately, the rifle can. is a tier 4. But you could just bring a... Um, uh, you could just bring the... Like a wind, wind generator. Yeah. Wait, this the is, rifles, this is the quite the portable three, base you're going to be it? carrying around. Yeah. I'm looking at the rifles tier 3. Oh, dang it. Uh, is there two kinds of rifle? There are two kinds. I was going to say, the one I was... Oh, is it the bolt action? Yeah. Ah, you got the hunting rifle. I got you the good rifle. It turned out it was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> it is a good option for, like, we could put... We could put them at various little outposts, like wherever we've got a bridge or where we've got the ramp, Oof. like the stairway to get um, up to the titanium mine and stuff. It could be useful for that. Nicely. I might be able to make a bit of a stone path of sorts. A little more um, path and a little less paving paradise like TFE's one. <laughs> we'll bend the range where I will. Yes, it has something I've tried to stop doing in these sort of games recently, is just, yeah, turning it into a one big... <laughs> ...base. Yeah, it's... Like, from a from a design perspective, there's there are big advantages to leaving other bits, because then you've got more variety. Hmm. Plus you can have, like, little buildings for each separate thing. Well, that's that's kind of what I thought here might, have, might work for us, because then it, also it gives a chance for everyone to design a bit of a building because once we have enough space for all the production buildings we can then have a building each for our house mm. but of course that's working against the concept of having a floating base up amongst the mountain things it did seem a bit pie in the sky 
it's something we could definitely do, given yeah, what just... Kampak and I achieved in the on sticks. But no, I feel like I'm gonna have more fun doing this. And then to end the series, Kapak can leap off. Now, <laughs> or have some sort of ramp. Parachute. A turbine on top of a building? Or does it have to be placed on the terrain? Thanks, Beldedick. Thank you for 14 months. Uh, it might need like a flat platform. Four and more. Aluminium. 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 Transparent aluminum? It'll be really annoying. Combine the first half and the second half different pronunciations. Uh. Can't really do that without aluminium. Aluminium. <laughs> aluminum? Yeah. <laughs> All right, leveled up. Or aluminium. The... Oh, I just noticed how, yeah, the thing for making gunpowder from fertilizer. The skill below it is called Get Off My Lawn. Where it's a recipe to make the rusty shotgun on the machining bench. <laughs> yeah, it's not real great though. Planted crops grow faster. Aluminium, yes. Uh, yeah, it does look like it wants to be on terrain. Oh no, you can place it on foundation blocks or flooring. Hmm. Oh. Doesn't really matter. Actually, it doesn't care whether it makes right nearby. planted crops grow faster. I should probably replant them all and they'll grow better. Uh, that doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Oh, well, we've got heaps of seeds. Basically, I've got a skill now that gives me 10% plant growth speed. Yeah, but if, if the plant has already been growing for longer than 10% of its growing time, you're not going to have any benefit if you rip up all the plants and replant. Well, maybe. <laughs> I just do it when you feel like they've been, when they get the debuff from being picked too many times. Hmm. What's the trick? Yeah, maybe. All oh, right, all this slight beans and stuff. To make some internal wood beams. Actually, no, for the, that one I think I'll use regular wood beams for the barn. Fancy wood beams. Dang it. It's still complaining. I really wish there was a way stuff. to um, see with these wind turbines whether they were placed poorly before you placed them. Uh, does it show the radius thing around them when you're trying to place them? No. Yeah. It's like Valheim seeds. And you find out afterwards that you've wasted them. Yeah, exactly. Except in this, you just pick it up again. Now, what can I go and test the sledgehammer on? I there's a drac or something around Splitzy. here. Splitzy. Not sure that would prove its effectiveness against animals. Actually, I think we can find a bit of fire. So. Uh, what else did I unlock? I got the. Yeah, but, oh, the chemistry bench. Need a whole bunch of composites. Yeah, which are expensive for us right now. We just killed all the animals in the vicinity. Here's something, I can't see it. Oh, it's a drag. 
Sledgehammer time. Oh, okay, that worked. Let's whack it in the head. <laughs> That's a dragon ring. Whoop. Well, TFB's voice went weird there for a second. Oh, did I become a robot briefly? Uh, it's more like feedback. Oh. Weird. Uh, are we out of steel? Alright, I haven't actually connected that. I think we might be out of steel. Uh, possible. I did make some more steel bloom. Okay. Uh, How did I miss that? There is no steel bloom. There's a whole bunch of inert, volatile substance. Are you, are you seed looking oil in the correct for? one? Because there are in all of them. Well, there are four things to look through there. Yeah, there's no steel bloom in any of them except the steel bloom I just queued for manufacture. Really? Yep. Weird. But now I have oil. Actually, I haven't mentioned any about the one the one percent chance to instantly break not being that useful. What percentage do you think it should be? No. Um, I mean, I wouldn't go. Wouldn't yeah, you go wouldn't go too hard on it. Just yeah, go... probably go like three or four percent, maybe. Yeah. The additive percentage adds up pretty quickly. How many times do you want to strike it to have a good chance to oh, have the thing drop, I guess? I'd probably say like 10 or 15 hits. And should it be something that drops every time you're breaking something, or should it not? Every hit, 100%. Fell every tree with one chop. Oh, hemorrhage. Ow. Why are you bleeding? Yeah, you don't want to do uh, that. I was finding a track. Oh, Let's get the sledgehammer. Doing your research. I yeah. See. <laughs> I see. Yeah, the drags must have some bonus to doing wounds or something, because they seem to always oh, bleed me certainly. or something when I fight them. Okay, so you picked up two traps at them. Yeah, good. What we got on the old quest board? Oh yeah, we haven't done a mission in a while. Yeah, we can probably do one shortly. Do we want a basic one or do we want a big fancy operation? I think just a basic one. We've got locate an abandoned base. It is hard. I've got a crazed creature that has been driven mad and is easy. Um, you choose. Yeah, let's go for a crazy creature. Oh, it's just around there. Too far away. Oh, I should get some food buffs before I go hunting. Yeah. Eat this vegetable pie. This vegetable oh, roll. Well, I guess we're going then. <laughs> well, I already had food, so I didn't need to go back in. And because we're fighting a thing, I figured we wouldn't take him take mounts because then they get eaten. How far are we going? No, you're not far. It's not far. I have not yet put a ramp in the back door of the barn. No. 
Need to do that. We'll get to that. At some point. Probably. Where is this, where is this crazy critter? I assume Splitzy's killed it already. Hey, here we go. Roaming beast. Yeah. I have killed it. Well, I couldn't kidding. even get a shot on it because you're standing in front of it. They weren't kidding when they said it was easy. <laughs> well, you had to go and make the comment about me having killed it before you got there, so of course I'm going to go kill it before you get there. TFE is going to steal the rewards. Um, oh, wait, there's some um, food. That might what are be the, the best options? One. <laughs> we, got, we got some fruit pie, some saltwater steamy, and some roast vegetables. Then there's some fishing stuff, and then there's knife attachments. I'm Commander Shepard, and I Ooh, approve of this carcass burglary. Carcass harvesting attachment. Um, well, yeah, probably just the fruit pie one. I mean, does Capac want the fishing <laughs> stuff? I think the uh, thing is, it's a fishing food, it's not the... Oh, food from fish. It's like, yeah, fish pie, some fillet and some chunks. Yeah, that's right. fine. Right. I was going to say, unless we want the carcass harvesting attachment for the knife. Laws just mentioned the fact that I said that Breakfast at Tiffany's is an old pop culture reference on the same channel as Gra Weep Bana Weep Ninny Bong. Yeah, that's, that's a fair, fair comment. Yay, five five thousand XP for Splitsy <clears throat> shooting a bear a couple of times. All right, now we've got an easy builder watchtower, or we've got a medium located Ooh. downed drone should, and protect we it while it uploads the, data. We may need, like, if we want to get more beacons. Oh, do whatever you want. Watchtower it is. Oh dear. Oh no, this is the prototype beacon. This one's useless. Ugh. Well, the you pot don't... for it just came down way over in the swamp. It's only lost where you get to do the thing. Uh. Wait, what's taking off again? Yeah, because I'm carrying the portable beacon right now. There you go, it's in the shed, you can use it. Um. And I, I would also agree, Loen, that um, Breakfast at Tiffany's is less obscure than Bar Weep Grana Weep Nidimog. In the shed? Where in the shed? Not in the shed, in the... the in the shed. <laughs> There's a wood cupboard with building parts in the main house. What? <laughs> Directions. I am delirious. The opposite of the I'm shed. Uh, Alright, guess I need some building materials. Maybe like scorious, so I guess I'll take those. Yep. <laughs> scorious horrible. It's just I mean, so ugly. Yeah, and the fact it doesn't have any build cost reduction talent. It's like, why would we use it? Well, no, it's... Yeah, it should be counted as stone. Yeah, it should. They should have made those particular things work on the similar materials. I'll do for now. I'll make these prettier later. Um, yeah. Time to move some animals. Past the Great Wall of Timber. Oh, I cheese and bacon. I want cheese and bacon. Yeah, like I know what Scory is useful for and I'll use it for that, but it's, I'm not a fan of... I, that aesthetic just doesn't... It's like it's obsidian, it's lava proof, isn't it? Yeah. It just looks messy. 
and it doesn't look different enough to stone at a distance for me to feel like it's nice to have the varied appearance. It just looks like stone that someone left in the water for too long. It's got barnacles all over it. But it, it, this is aesthetics. Personal preference. Yeah. What am I doing? I needed to get some stuff, some things, and what's it? Um... Oh, that's right. I was just creating rooms so I can pick up more of the animal stuff. Oh. Hmm. Yes? Probably should have brought a foundation. Oh, well. Uh, you just need to bring pillars. That's right. I'll just wedge some in the ground. No, as in, I don't think you'll be able to get the walls to go that high without pillars to support them. Well, find out. Is this one just immune to bullets or? So many water trees. Either that or the spread is so bad I keep missing. <laughs> what spread? There's no spread. Um, there is, I'm pretty sure, because there's a skill that reduces it. Or is that for shotguns? That's shotguns. Uh, normal rifle? Yeah, there's no spread. You see point, it hits point. Also, no, it gives no, you the, extra bonuses to make for, it hit even more There's a skill that reduces spread for all firearms. I've, honestly, all I've ever noticed is that it feels like I've got aim assist. Even without the skill for that. So if there is one, it feels very unnecessary. <laughs> Yes, there was one very oblivious bird. I'm firing bullets past it, just standing there not noticing. Yay, well lit on. Like, I'm. I'm. That's four shots at a key and missed all of them. <laughs> Is, oh, um, you're probably dealing with latency. Well, keys are actually really hard to hit, apparently. Because uh, <laughs> I just missed one shooting it twice. Might, might need you to make me some scoria building materials. Oh, I've only got ping over, what, 20? Is there bad music in the base? There's, there's a inside. swoopy bird floating around. Thank Red Wings. Uh, there's something attacking the wall. Shooting here is hit scan. Hmm, could be. Yeah, I'm pretty sure with this rifle it's hit scan. Come on, baby horse. Cross the bridge. Let's go. So I'll wait around for a bit. On juvenile mowers, get out of there. I want to be really lazy and level up quickly. I would just craft a million stone pieces. <laughs> do you have the recipe to make scoria stuff? Why do you um, need I scoria do. stuff? I, I have... built this tower for this quest that I've been talking about. For why the past does it have to minutes. be scoria? Because that's what I got. So why does it have to match? I do have the recipes for scoria. Could you make me some foundations and floors, please? Uh, sure, one sec. Some more iron nails, chuck them in. Uh, there are a much, bunch of animals you think that you guys have to move yourselves because I can't move them for you. Uh, I don't know, like three or four of each. 
So three or four frames and then... Oh, and the there's a few floors. Mowers. Same number of floors. Wait, so you want both uh, base and floor or just floor? Yeah, both. Okay. What I don't want is watermelon. Get out of here, watermelon. Ridiculous juvenile animals. Oh, let's get more scory out of here. You don't, you don't want to be in there? You don't have to be in there. I don't care anymore. I don't know. I'm over in Cumber Road. Now, you've already taken the stuff? Yep, I got it. Yep, you don't need any more? Uh, no, that should be good. Let's get rid of some of these fibers. Get every get a saddle on all the animals. Is it's so annoying. Uh, I thought I saw no a couple saddles. of spare saddles I did make uh, a around the place. I don't know if I can put saddles on your animals though. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. Yeah. If you can't put the saddle on the animal, just sort of perch it on top of the animal. <laughs> yes. There is a distinct difference between these two things. is smart enough to lay, lay itself down on the bed. Yeah. Okay. Wait, really? Iron Javelin does more projectile damage than a rifle round. TFA, did you have like 12 food troughs or something? Um, I don't think so. I think I had like... Why did you have so many? I was trying to spread them out so all the animals weren't in one corner, but it didn't quite work. Because they just go to whichever one you've just built anyway? Yeah. I mean, it yeah. sort of worked, but then I think they congregated near the door. Yeah. Let's just leave the ones in the middle of the floor like I got in the other one then. I think it's probably easier if we keep them to just like one trough of each. And then make sure those are filled, and then they'll all just congregate around that, and at least then you know where they are. We just need to not. We just just need to stop collecting so many dang animals. Yeah. Not too many. We haven't found another buffalo. <laughs> oh yeah, fair point. If we find a buffalo, we can bring that home. If find a buffalo, make sure we back home. It's getting its own special pen. <laughs> Uh, a couple more to move, and then I can start demolishing the existing barn. Oh, the wheat spoiled. Dang it. I guess that's the downside of it growing faster. It spoils faster. Sooner. Oh. It's more support. The old barn has more floor space, but is harder to use because of the lower ceiling. Mm. Higher ceiling in here makes it much easier to move around and see where the animals are and things. Mm, maybe I need some pillars too. 
We're when Finland's coming with... right up. Um, how many would you need, hypothetically? <laughs> uh, let's say... 12? Yep. Well, I've got diarrhea now, so let's just fill from the creek. Uh, I really wish there was a way to fill the fill the water containers um, from a water source without having to drink from said water source. Um, because I'm trying to fill the water troughs over here, and it'd be a lot easier if that was. Wait, the case. why aren't you filling them from the rain collectors? Because the animals don't need that water. Just starve them until we need them. <laughs> oh wait, the watering can probably is a way to do this, isn't it? Because the watering can you can't drink from. Why not? <laughs> wait, we have 26 clay bricks from quest item? Yeah, we've got a random, bunch of random quest item stuff. There's... 22 shotgun shells from one as well. I don't know what the deal is with those either. Why are these horses so angry? Daisy, you're so irritating. Oh, Daisy. I'm tempted. I'm very tempted. Yeah. Apparently that's also a method to shortcut the quest. What? Kill Daisy? Yeah. I think the bit where you take him back to base, you can just kill him. <laughs> ah, yeah. Stupid mower, get out of the way of Daisy. These plants finally grow now. All right. Animals are moved to the barn. Hooray! The light. Ah, over there. Oh, what? Where? How? Over there. You didn't realize where I'd put it until just no. now. Right. To say they get better lighting than we have indoors. Uh, yes, because their building is more recent, therefore it's got better lighting. <laughs> I intend to make all the others better too. I just don't intend to fix them until I've built them bigger. in a way that's useful. Uh, come back making things, me breaking things. What is happening? <laughs> is it upside down day? Right, will this be high enough? satisfying building a oh. new thing and then clearing out the old thing to make room for more new things. Acid storm. Wait. Oh. You're, oh, you're, you're over in the swamp. I wonder if he's going to get eaten like he did. Yeah, that went really badly for me last week. Mm-mm. 
Oh, we get a hailstorm instead. Fantastic. Don't have anything to make a light source. Great. Oh, that's problematic. Oh, I've got shelter. So there's that. Um, oh, that's good. Can turn this floor into something else, or we just get rid of it? Um, I don't know yet. You can do whatever. Hmm. I was kind of starting over at the barn and then I'm going to make it make some other stuff over there but yeah if you want to pick a spot to like make your own little house you can do that it just needs to be right up against the fence yeah um, I guess but I think we probably want to get down um, the main paths through here so that we've got yeah. easier ways to remember where the entrances actually are before we do anything like that yeah that's what we use all the extra floor for Have a look. I need these movement talents next to running around with a gun. And Wait, is this Scoria for? Some will be, yeah. You yeah. look like you used some. Increased crit multiplier. If I did, I definitely need it on purpose. <laughs> Chance to not consume ammo. This seems pretty good. Uh oh. Here, beasts. Ouch, the storm is hurting. Did you have foundations under this floor or was it just floor? I think it was just floor. I didn't bother the foundation. Is that snowball frog always been there? Yes. It was there before we even started making the base. Yes. Was what? Where? The rug by the entrance. The main bit of the house. Oh, Kamak likes making rugs. It's been there a while. Or there have been rugs here a while. I don't know if that particular one's been there a while. DV, can you order up some more foundations, stone frames? Uh, yep. Make. Oh, need to grab more stone. I can make up to seven. Wait, um, there's some right outside? Uh, no more house in the clouds. Not yet, at the least. I feel like we needed more space for putting down all of our different crafting benches and just needed more room in general uh, before we went to making anything that grand. I thought it'd be more fun to actually build something that we can uh -oh. use straight away rather than starting a oh, project just with a a, such a big reach. Okay, I can make 19 stone frames now. Uh, yeah, make 10? Maybe? Eight. For now. Amazing, they craft in like that 1.3 seconds or something. Yeah, it's so much better once you get the water hook up. Oh. Oh dear. What have you done? It's a biscuit. Quite close. Oh. Oh, it's 398 XP per stone. Not bad. I don't think the plants get damaged from weather. No. I'm pretty no. sure you're correct there. From what I've seen anyway. said why I said no I'm pretty sure you're correct there that came out wrong but you know what I mean yeah you're correctly saying this does not occur <laughs> no you are correct sir what Actually, I make more food. I don't want to stand on top of the kitchen bench. 
dangerous, I'll probably fall backwards into the fire. Seem like a thing that could happen. More spoiled food for the imposter. This is some strong plants. People take damage from hail, but plants, they feel different. <laughs> right, I think the storm. Yeah, hail, no problem, but person in a suit, oh no, I've been injured. <laughs> Very dark. Oh, I can make 40 vegetable pie. Uh, Inventory space and whatever you're making stuff in to do that. No. And what was the other ones? It was vegetable roll and... Vegetable roll, vegetable pie and shepherd's pie. Oh, vegetable vol. Yeah, vegetable vol. No, I'm building a sign to put next to the kitchen table so I don't forget. <laughs> Seems like a decent idea. Oh wait, especially as there's those um, new signs. Oh uh, wait, that doesn't work. No. Why? I have to unlock them. Why can't I unbuild this? Is it damaged? No, it's just gone. Wait, what? Search sign and it's highlighting animal bed, steel spear, what? The steel spear of animals is a sign. Wait, is it tier three? It's rustic. We've got the rustic bench somewhere, I think. I've been outside or in the forge sort of area. Bench. Hey, oh. well done, Kevin. Whoa, geez, the flicker of the blue from the thing. Yeah. Can you that's, take away um, that bacon, Kamak? Yeah, that's um, an epilepsy warning. Nope. Why not? Because I can't. No option. No, you, you demolish the thing that it's supported by. Well, it's not doing anything anyway. No, that's class working bench. Good. Yeah, I thought we had a rustic bench, I just can't find it. All oh, this stuff creeping around down there in the dark, I can't even see what it is. I'm just blind like normal. Thank you for the follow, JT. Yeah, that's difficult to pronounce. JT. Dio Kening? Idio Kojima. Deckening. JT Deckening, I think, is how it's meant to be pronounced. Oh, that's not right. Well, I guess I'm just hiding out here until morning. Curses! Is there no way to rotate these stupid things? Oh, the Rustic Signs Tier 1 has just crafted a new character. That's... What? Yes, the rustic signs are actually. Yeah, craft by person. Oh, and they don't use the. Some stuff as the normal signs? Wait, Mama, get over here. Oh, yeah, the rustic signs use cheaper stuff. They just use basic things rather than nails and whatever. Makes sense. They just, yeah, wood, stick, and fiber. Oh, you suck, Moa. Even though Moa was killed by Splitty. What? He sucks <laughs> more than what? I'm done with this stupid Moa. Because he's had enough and goes on a murder spree. Ugh. So he annoying. He finally broke him. Some half pieces. No, Jason was already killed. 
last week. Damn, that Jason versus Freddy movie. Oh, I see a goop trail from a viscid. Let's see, got catharsis mood plus 40. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. That work. Might be better if I put a little. Oh, that's what I'll do. Oh, I wonder if there's any water I could reach. Maybe I could be fishing. We still got lots of. Oh, that sounded like a splash. Uh, it feels like still got plenty in the ice box. In fact, yeah, the ice box is still full. Uh, there are two ice boxes. Three, isn't there? Yeah, but two of them I had filled with stuff. There's the third one's been filled now. Cool. Ooh, a Titan Piranha. I've not seen one of those before. Open the field guide. Atheus Swamp. No, it's not there. Uh, is there a different category for fishes? What are we hearing? Um, some outdoor lighting. Oh. Uh oh. That will potentially oh, no. continue around the place to try and make it so we don't need torches at all in our base. Dreadwing. I want Dreadwing swooping at me in the dark. And you can't take it any mower. Yep. Oh, fishing record. There we go. Is it Titan Piranha? So TFE puts the wooden sign on the metal oven rather than on the wooden thing right next to it. Oh, the swamp counts as salt well. water. the sign on the thing you do it on. Although yes you do have a point. in there. Oops. What did you do? I went to change my fishing rod and cast, but it didn't change and it stayed on my rifle and I fired my rifle. Oh. <laughs> it sounds Oops. so much worse. That's the kind of thing where Kefak will overreact to something minor and then be, be very chill while he's currently being digested by an animal. <laughs> yeah. Another piranha. Just going through the cupboard eating random food that's about to spoil. Yeah. I mean, if you let it spoil, then it um, 
just makes more fertilizer when I get the pounds. Yeah, but it seems wasteful letting good food spoil. Here's the reward pod, can I? Why haven't you picked it up yet? Because it's very dark. Is your lantern blown out or something? Yeah, he doesn't have one. Do you want me to join you over there, Capac? I'm, I'm, I'm doing fine fishing. Fine on the barn. What animals are us or something? Barn? It's a, it's a sign that says barn. Yeah. Makes sense a to me. Warning, barn. <laughs> yeah. Now I'm tempted to put one out the front, it's just warning, gate. <laughs> warning, woodpile. Warning, door. Warning, river. Warning, Komodo. Hey, what's considered to be the front door on the barn? The one with the light on the outside. I didn't think it was that difficult to determine based on how I designed it. We... Oh, here's, here's the reward. What reward do you want, Kamak? Yes. Um, oh, I guess the metals. Iron ore, iron ingot, copper ingots. Yeah. Cop yep. Ooh, leveled up. You, Kamak. I'm on top of the tower that I built. Oh, you blue marker. I couldn't see your player marker underneath the other marker. What is this game all about? Um, mainly Coral trying to Dorado. avoid getting eaten by creatures. Hey, Quality 64%. <laughs> you happy staying here or would you like an escort home? Uh, I'll come back now that I've got my... You fishy. Um, I haven't played Rust on One Grey, um, but it's very much PVE rather yeah. than PVP. All right, let's go. Watch out for right, viscids. Let me know if I'm running ahead of you too much. Uh, you are. I have no Dang it, I could have got that so skill then that if fast. I didn't get the language speed skill. I mean, you're not even sprinting. Yeah. Why not? Because my stamina bar only lasts for a few seconds. Uh, why? Shouldn't your stamina bar last very long? Because I have no, no food buffs! Oh, I listened to that bit. Yeah, but not yeah. so much. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I'm to watch chat at the same time. Drink the Oh, another needle. About time to need to reload. Yeah, there's a Komodo and Terranius over here. Oh, the horse is after me! Watch out, there's a mower! <laughs> I like how I'm just messing around a face, okay. I just hear rhythmic gunfire in the back. They're all dead, damn it. Run! Run for your lives! Harvest this needle. Oh, it's so purple out here. Ah, my eyes. Ow. Oh, you bit me. 
Wasn't I did that not. Hard. No, the Dreadwing. Something bit me and I didn't know what, and I sh turned around and shot the juvenile mower because <laughs> I thought it was it. Ah, which one of these is the actual gate? The three actual gates? The gates are slightly taller than the rest of the thing. I'm at one right now. Wow. <laughs> the timing on that. <laughs> Slamming the door shut and come back to Like, where have you been hoarding all this green glowy nonsense? Uh, the forge bench thing. Oh, the building chest is full. Oh no, I'm gonna run out of space for fishes. Then you have one carrot seed? That doesn't seem right. Yeah, I'm leaving that beacon because that beacon can't be changed. I want the other beacon that you get from the other mission, I think. If we're going to be trying to go after beacons. But, um, as it has gotten extremely hot in my shed, I think I might call it there for today for my strings. Hold on, I gotta put up my fish trophies first. Are you going to keep streaming, come back? Uh, I might do a couple of dark tides, maybe. TFE, I presume you're going to call it there and then uh, yep. do some more evening streams as you've been doing. Uh, before I forget, chat, I will be back early tomorrow morning for some Dyson Sphere program. Uh, at the same time that I normally start, normally would start on today's stream, I'll be starting tomorrow. Which I'll be doing up until I play some Baldur's Gate with Kapak over on his channel. So that's tomorrow. Uh, obviously no stream at this time next week because that would be Ooh. Christmas. Shiny fish. But I will be back on Friday with some more Twitch integration space engineers, if not tomorrow. Or Dyson Sphere program. That was all very convoluted, but there's stuff coming. Yeah. Be here tomorrow. Bat. Um, oh, there's gate. Oh, there's gate. <laughs> so yeah, there's all that and plenty more to come. And I will raid camp back in a moment. Alrighty. Uh, there you go. And make sure you check out TFE's schedule for his streams because they're in Aussie evenings when I am never live. So, useful time. I guess. 